Um, so we're here tonight at uh, La Trobe University in the city. Um, we've got a symposium tonight talking about all things athlete development and wellbeing. Um, joining me on the panel tonight, um, we've got Nikki Kirsten, who's Player Development Manager at the Hawthorne Footy Club. Uh, we've got Matt Spanger, who's obviously a, an AFL player at the Hawthorne Footy Club. Um, Paul O'Halloran, who's from La Trobe University. And Paul Kitely, who's from the VIS. Having something other than football itself, I mean, I can't speak for other sports, but obviously in AFL, it's been an area that's probably been developing in the last, say, the last five years and uh, it's becoming an increasingly more important part. So certainly in times where long, uh, certainly long term injuries and things like that, it proves there's a great distraction and actually at least have folks who don't go a little bit crazy, that sort of cabin fever that you can get from being in rehab and things like that. So um, for me personally, it's, it's been a great tool my whole career. So and it's one I'll continue using while I'm still playing. Player development's really important and I think it needs to be embedded as a respected part of the footy program. Um, and it also helps on field performance. Um, we've got research that supports that now. Um, as a duty of care, obviously, you know, we draft you know, athletes out of high school um, and take them straight into a high performance environment. Um, but, you know, the, the growth and development of our athletes is so important. They give so much to the game and you know, as an industry and especially the PA, we need to support them along their journey. Don't just get discouraged if something doesn't work first up. For me, I mean, I started off at La Trobe as a podiatry student, didn't work for me. Then did you know like a financial planning degree wasn't for me either and then eventually did a bit of a generic business degree but so it's taken me a long time to figure out what I want to do other than play football so don't just get discouraged and don't get pigeonholed into one thing so and don't be afraid to take the next step really that would be the one thing I could offer.